Hello and welcome to Bullion RV. My name is Tristan and today I'm going to be showing you this brand new 2022 Tax Outdoors Cricut Standard Edition. But before I do that, as you can tell, we are Tax Outdoors Northland dealership. These guys come all the way up from Texas and we have every single floor plan that they have to offer. However, today I'm going to be showing you the standard model of the Cricut. So first things first, this unit comes in at 15 feet long weighing approximately 1,753 pounds dry. As you can see, you got a bit of a pop-up right here. You got an awning, I'm not gonna take out for you today, but it comes out, I would say, just about to where this fish house would be. You can also have a kind of an awning with the back door in the back. Otherwise, up front here, you got two 20-pound propane tanks. You got a manual jack tongue right here at the wheel. These units are small enough, you can drag them around your backyard if you need to adjust them. Otherwise, you do have an outdoor shower right here. This unit sits on four stabilizer jacks that are manually put down. Here's gonna be your portable water and your shower power connection. And then there's also an inlet if you wanna add a solar panel to help charge the battery, which is gonna be found on the inside. Unfortunately, I couldn't give you guys any power today because it's only given this big boy and the battery connection is on the inside i'll show you where that is it's actually just below this window right here otherwise you sit on nice big outdoor tires with aluminum rims filled with nitrogen i believe those are 15 inch tires and you have about 15 inches of clearance as well that's where you're going to fill your portable um tank you got about 15 gallons of fresh water and then a 16 gallon gray water tank on the inside you have tule um bars up top and the one step this nice frame you can access all your gear up here you can adjust these bars as well otherwise here's your rear door that kind of acts as an awning you get a full-size spare tire down below and there's even a light for your license plate back here kind of funny otherwise you have about 25 feet of basement storage below what is your bed and also your dinette so as you can tell right now it's in dinette mode however when you want to put in a bed mode, you just bracket that down. It sits on the edges there. You take this pad, making a nice, about, full, about a full-size bed. Coming around to the passenger side, this is called the service window. You can crank this open, basically serve out of it if need be. Otherwise, it just acts as the big window that faces towards your campsite. And if you have any more 12-volt appliances you want to run outside, you have a couple hookups hidden here and there to do such things. Let's take a step inside. So this unit also comes with a little, I think it was that, like pirate ship racks. You can put some kids up there, as long as they're less than 130 pounds. Otherwise, you can put plenty of gear up there for your next adventure. Again, you got LED lights throughout the inside and outside of this unit. And to my right, you have your storage tower. Below it, you have your portable toilet right here. You got about five gallons worth, so again, those are pretty nice because you can dump those just about anywhere you need to. You got two more storage racks right there with milk crates. And I know milk crates are funny, but they're basically indestructible. You got a little bit more storage right here as well. Otherwise, your Truma Eco Combi Furnace. So that's going to be your furnace and your hot water heater. It's going to be controlled from this guy right here along with all your lights. You do have some outlets, voltage reader, your breaker box. And then some more storage goes right here. Otherwise, again, your battery panel is right here. So once you get your battery, put it back here. I didn't uh, want to run those huge cables in here and risk making this place not look as pretty as it deserves to look. Otherwise, again, you got more outlets hidden just about everywhere. All these windows have day and night shades. I guess you can call them bug screens as well. And they also do open up every single one. I just gotta lock it with this to keep it posted. Otherwise, above me, you do have a 12 volt van, fan. You want to air this place out to get a nice pass through um, airflow. You crank that on, you get plenty, if not more than needed. Otherwise, for cooking, then you got plenty of countertop space right here. I got some of my own loot up here right now. But if you're pre preparing a meal, you got that. You can wash your vegetables or whatnot right here in the sink. And then when it comes to cooking, you got a two burner gas stove top right here. So 
So again, with this pop top up, you got plenty of space until you start getting over here, but you're going to be sitting or laying down when it comes to that side of the unit anyways. And Tax Outdoors, they state that all their products are everything you need and nothing you don't. And I believe that's very, very accurate of a statement. Again, my name is Tristan here at Bullion RV. This is a 2022 Tax Outdoors Cricut Standard Edition. If you have any questions about this unit, please feel free to call me at 218-336-3622. Otherwise, I look forward to hearing you guys in the next one. If you have any other questions also about any of the Tax Outdoors products, we got them and we got the answers. Otherwise, take care, bye-bye.